But Azusa with the details. Gene, good morning. Good morning, Frank and Jessica. There are a lot of nuances to the story, many different layers. Now, the Aztecs will keep their name. That's after a school board meeting with the district and the superintendent. However, they're still talking about this image, the logo that we're talking about there with the headdress. Uh, they're going to be keeping their colors. However, parents and students have this to say. I graduated here, and I've always been an Aztec. Once an Aztec, always an Aztec. That's what we say. And changing it to make someone else happy is just silly. Um, I feel like we, I don't really see it as offensive. Maybe if we took off the headdress and maybe dressed it a different way, maybe people won't find it offensive. A lot of different opinions from the students and the parents that I've been talking to. Now, here's some background. Azusa High's mascot has been the Aztecs since 1956. That's when they opened their doors. Azusa Unified School District met last night as part of the district's big reorg plan. Gladstone High School in Covina will be turned into a middle school for the next school year. So students from Gladstone will then merge with rival Azusa High. So that's also another part of this story. Well, the controversy involves mascots for sports related to indigenous people being challenged at all levels. We're talking from grade school to college sports to even professional teams. Now, some superintendent remarks Arturo Ortega is aware that this is a sensitive subject for the students and alum of both of the schools and has been receiving many different opinions for, against, and in the middle of the road. Gladstone's athletic director wants a fresh start for the new school and uh, they want a new identity with a new mascot. Now, if it is changed, the football field, marquee, and murals, they would all need a transition, a makeover, if you will. It would cost them about a hundred to a hundred fifty thousand dollars. So the school district and the board members, they voted in favor once again of forming a special committee to investigate if they're going to change the mascot image that you see there, inviting indigenous people to the table and also some people from the school examining possible respectful options. Do they keep it? Do they even come up uh, with an animal? That was also discussed during their meeting yesterday. Um, or if they just keep this image all together. Uh, but they say once again, they're going to keep the Aztec's name, keeping the blue color as well. Uh, but coming up through this morning, uh, we have reached out to the superintendent, uh, Superintendent Ortega, and uh, we may be able to talk to him uh, live. Reporting live here at Azusa High School, Gene Kang, back to you in the studio.